doing a shootout with mini amps. Um, we got uh, Epiphone Valve Jr. and the MV50 AC31, AC I mean, and we're just trying to see what they sound like coming through uh, different, um, through my speaker of the cabinet that I bought. That right there, this guy right here is the MV50 Vox a a AC, MV50, um, and this is the very popular Valve Jr. This one's got some mods on it. It's got uh, gain and negative feedback, and actually, around back, it has a treble boost. So, um, what? and then this is my cab I built out of an old Samsonite. Um, might build another one. That one's got a 10-inch pile driver in it. And uh, I'm going to see how they sound. So I got the Vox MV50 AC. We got um, the gain in the tone right in the middle-ish. Volume's about, I don't know, two-thirds this way. Settings in the back. It is EQ'd. I'm not on off. And I've got it on flat EQ. 8-ohm speaker. This is 8-ohm speaker. Just going to play a few chords through it just to see how it sounds. Um, using the uh, neck and the middle pickup. We'll just turn it all the way up just to see. All right, now we're going to try the same basic chord, same little um, with the Epiphone Valve Jr. Come here, Royce, you can see the settings here. I got the gain about half up. This is a, a mod. Negative feedback, I have that off because there's nothing similar to that in there. Volume is right there. This is only a 5 watt amp versus uh, 25 watts going through the 8 ohms. This is also the 8 ohm speaker. So we'll just see how this one sounds and we'll compare. <laughs> I mean, everything seems a little more controlled with the Vox. It seems a little bit, like, compressed, I guess. The Epiphone, I feel, is uh, kind of farty in some of the low end. Um, and it may be by the way I play as well, but I really, you know, and maybe it is 5 watts and it is, like, Class A, but I know it's a little different. I like the way it sounds. This sounds a lot warmer, but this has a lot more control a little more compression i guess um through this little hand built speaker cab 10 inch speaker cab um i know that this thing can take the wattage both of either of those are putting out i mean right now i'm really liking the way the vox sounds through with the um the vox sounds through the the speaker cab i have to do a little more probably have to do a little more experimentation I'd like to know what a 12 inch speaker would sound like um, I'm hearing a couple rattles that I'd probably fix, but all in all, I think uh, I think the Vox wins this shootout.